What's going on, you bad good fellow sports TV? I appreciate everybody for checking back in. Let's get right into it. Nipsey Hustle will be having a memorial service this Thursday at the Staples Center that hosts twenty one thousand people. Um, so he going out, you know, like a king should go out, man. And um, you got the Bloods and the Crips uniting over this, and um, you know, he deserves a, a, a go out like a king, man. To be honest, he really do, man. Um, so many great stories about him mending relationships between father and son and giving back to the community <clears throat> and, um, you know, a lot of stuff, man. So I'm glad that he going out in style 21,000 at the, uh, Staples center. That's going to show up. They selling tickets. Um, uh, I believe TMZ will have the exact website or you have to just check Staples center. It's a quick turnaround because the night before that, the Clippers play their final regular season game, and they are, I think, going to be in the playoffs too. So they have to take that court up and uh, get ready for memorial service. So for people saying that that Nipsey Hussle impact was uh, pretty much predicated on his music, it wasn't. He was a street legend, man. And being from Detroit, I know a ton of street legends, but he was a street legend not because of uh, negativity. He was known for his positivity, man. And bringing joy to the hood and changing people's lives and trying to put brothers back on the on the right track, trying to see the good in people when 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 everybody just say see the bad in them, and that was kind of pretty much what got them trying to you know help everybody. And I learned that in life, you can't help everybody, man. You got to make sure you help yourself first, help your loved ones, your immediate family, and then you go on from there. But that's just what he was about, you know. And you you know somebody always want to be the, the the number one. You know, and that's the mentality of black people. It's the crab in a bucket mentality, man. <clears throat> they hate to see somebody on top, even if they they doing good. I mean, you go back to the Thousand Street stories. You go back to the Paid and Full story. And I'm I'm amazed the amount of people that know that was based on a true story, and they got the real story. <clears throat> excuse me, on YouTube as well too. And um, A Z, he was ace in the movie. He would feed everybody in the hood. Everybody was eating. He was feeding the streets. But guess what? That wasn't enough. They still wanted to pop him and kill him because they felt like they wanted to be the men. And that's run parallel to what happened to Nipsey Hussle, it sounded like. It's always somebody there, no matter how much you feed them, how much good you do to do for them, that just want to be you. They want to be in your position. You know what I'm saying? And you always want the king always get capped. In every story, the king always get capped. So, you know, I'm glad that he going out in style. He going out in power, you know. And people saying that, oh, they selling their mission tickets. Yeah, man, at the end of the day, it costs. It costs to uh, have a, a, a service at the, at the Staples Center. It costs for the lights. It costs for, you know, the whole energy, the lights, the, whatever, the gas, whatever else they got going, they got going on. It costs to use it, you know. It's a rental fee. It's a, they got bills to pay. It's like you holding a service at a church. It ain't free to go usually hold a service at a church. It costs bread. When people start that, that start talking that nonsense. So uh, rest in power to that brother, man. Blessings to him, man. Hopefully everything goes well and no, don't no ignorant stuff pop off, man. But he gonna be at the Staples Center going out in style. His memorial service, man. His, his fellow goodbye, his his fellow goodbyes, uh, to to everybody out there, man. So if you're in the L.A. area, you know, don't go over there on no BS. Go over there with positive positivity and vibes. Don't forget we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Reach out to the email, and um, don't forget to check out our sponsor, the Hellblaze, thehellblaze.com. Promo code Goodfellow One Box get you 18% off the 100% all natural products. Website promo code description. They got soaps, lotions, foot soaks, bath bombs, 100% all natural products, man. Made right here in the USA, not imported from nowhere else. They make it themselves, so go check them out. It's your boy CJ Goodfellow. I'll link the article link to TMZ in the description. You know, peace, love, prosperity, and uh, blessings to that brother Nipsey Hustle. Hopefully, he rests in power, and um, you know, hopefully, the, you know, the city of LA heal from this and somebody take his place and we can do better. We gone.